Alright, I wanted to go over real quick how to do the contact and sidebar pages. So, um, the first thing to do is let's go ahead and create some pages. So, let's add a new page and let's call this one contact page. And all you need to do is go under page attributes and select the page contact page. So, let's go ahead and publish this page and let's view it. And it doesn't look like much yet, but um, if you scroll down to the bottom, there's contact page options, and this is where we fill everything in. So if you had an address um, for your map, you just display it right here. So I'm just going to display San Francisco. Um, if you had an address, it would just go on one line, uh, you know, like so. Uh, you know, don't use any line breaks, but um, I'm just going to do San Francisco, California, and then you would update it, and then the map will automatically appear or disappear based on if you have an address filled in, and same with the um, contact form. So you would just type in your address or your email address, and it would display based on that. And then your content goes here. We'll do the same as well. So it's pretty nice and easy to display your contact page. So let's go ahead and do the same thing for our page with sidebar. All we do under page attributes is select our um, page with a sidebar. So if I view that page, we now have a page with a sidebar. So it's really, really easy to um, to do that, uh, have a page with a sidebar or our contact page. They're just simple um, page te templates that we select. 